In the U.S. announced that it is speeding up plans of sending Americans back to the moon. U.S. Vice President Mike Pence said that the administration plans to send American astronauts back to the moon by the year 2024 and not 2028 as planned before. Of our armed forces, the United what we need now is urgency. Now make no mistake about it. We're in a space race today, just as we were in the 1960s. And the stakes are even higher. Just as the United States was the first nation to reach the moon in the 20th century, so too will be, we be the first nation to return astronauts to the moon in the 21st century. And I'm here on the president's behalf to tell the men and women of the Marshall Space Flight Center and the American people that at the direction of the president of the United States, it is the stated policy of this administration and the United States of America to return American astronauts to the moon within the next five years. The billion dollar goal comes at a time when NASA is struggling to resume human space missions from U.S. soil. NASA's shuttle program ended back in the year 2011. Within months of taking office, U.S. President Donald Trump made it clear that he wants to reinvigorate the American Space Agency. In 2017, Trump set a goal to resend Americans to moon. The idea was to take a step closer to human exploration of Mars. Back then, NASA had adopted a schedule for 2028. Pence said that that goal was not good enough. Pence called for changes in NASA's approach and culture, reflecting the growing frustration over the delays in developing the giant rocket for moon. The NASA budget this year is $21.5 billion. The amount is the largest in recent years. Now let's get to work.